hello guys in this video we are going to update burp suite so let's get started so whenever you open burp suite and you see this thing so you need to click on the update now button and it will take you to this website and i'll provide this link for this website to you okay and you need to click on this download button and some page like this will show up so i'll provide this link don't worry about that and now uh, what you need to do is uh, even though you might be using a uh, Linux so uh, you need to put click on JAR okay you might be tempted to click on Linux but click on JAR and right now I'm using Kali Linux if you might have noticed already and now you need to click on the download button when you click on this download button as you can see I already downloaded this just now only I don't read actually so here it is downloaded and the downloaded files are in the download section so let's go there and as you can see this is um, the file which I downloaded okay so now uh, let's start with what we need to do so firstly we need to rename this file so to rename it you can either open it uh, via this and rename this thing just like normally rename to burp suit s u i t you can rename this or you can even do it like this where you can just move the name of the file and burp s u i b u r p s u i t yeah so remember this that we don't need this extension dot jar okay just keep it to burp suite just that's it just put sweet and simple burp suite now for example in when you're using python in kali linux and you type which python it will show you the location of the python where is it so once again i'll just close the burp suite yeah okay so just like that if i'll type which burp suite then it will tell me the location of burp suite so what i need to do is that i need to go to this location and i need to change this old burp suite to our new burp suite which is over here okay so let's do this so cd usr okay one second one more thing uh, this burp suite needs to be an executable file because you are running it right so chmod plus x to burp suite yeah now that's better now this is executable you can even make it executable like this also like over oh, here yeah, go to properties and we can yeah click on this allow this program to run this program it will make it executable okay now let's go to again if you want to remember the location which burp suite okay and this is the location so cd usr then let's go to bin and over here you will have lots and lots of stuff over here now there is something known as burp suite so let me just grab burp suite out of this grab burp and as you can see i've updated this quite many times so you can even remove your older files sudo rm verb suite dot let me just remove all of this old files in front of you guys yeah and uh, remember to do it in sudo okay because okay it's old okay yeah what is happening okay i already removed the file oh nice as you can see there is uh, i have removed the older files and now i have only one file which is simple burp suite and i'll rename it so again sudo into sudo to rename i'm going to use mv and this burp suit i'm going to rename it by um burp suit dot old okay now burp suit has been changed to burp suit dot old and over here i'll input my very new file which i just downloaded which is the latest version so for that i'll do sudo copy and you need to copy it from the downloads right so uh, i'll just do it better i guess uh, let's start from the root directory itself so aa let's just let's start from home a then downloads this a will be our username okay and then downloads and then the name of file is burp suite and copy it here right so just press enter 
and for destination file again you can just put burp suit okay so uh, make sure the spelling you're typing is the same otherwise it won't work now when it's done you can just um, run a grep command to check it so ls grep burp and see this is the new burp suite which we just added in and this is the old one older burp suite now if you have done this you can click on burp suite and this should open the new burp suite the updated one without the error okay just i'll just show it to you see i did not get any and you can delete the previous one as well so that's quite nice so this is the new burp suite which i've just updated and i'm opening it right now so see yep that's it so i hope you like this video like and subscribe and i'm sure that since you are um, using burp suite so i have a lot of videos on uh, burp suite port swigger labs if you are solving those so please like and subscribe and check those out bye bye